Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm gonna be eating at Culver's. Um, I'm in front of the menu of the building, so kind of hard to see. There's the there's the big sign, Culver's. I'm right next to it. So I'm gonna go uh, order my food, and I'll be back. I mean, yeah, can I have one of your Pretzel House uh, pub burger meals? Of course. What to drink? Um, a Diet Coke. Diet Pepsi? Medium or large size? Um, just the uh, medium. Ketchup or cheese sauce for your fries? Um, no. Anything else? Nope, that's it. 9.53, I'll see you at the window. Thank you. Thank you. How you doing? 953, thank you. Can you repeat? Uh, yes, please. Here you go. Go ahead and pull forward. Thank you. If they're in the way, just wait. When they move, you, you move. move. That's what I thought. Hi, number 93. Yep, me. Pretzel House Pub Double Basket with Fried Diet Pepsi Medium. Yep, that's me. Alright. Thank you very much. Have a great day. You too. Not too long away. Um six maybe six minutes altogether from ordering to to getting the food so i don't think that is bad at all so uh, let me um let me set up my uh, tray and my camera and stuff and i'll be right back all right here's my meal of course i got a drink so here's the fries just the medium fry and here's the pretzel house pub burger uh, the pretzel bun is, looks really good it smells really good um i see cheese in the burger i don't know what else is on here um looks like it has some kind of bacon maybe I don't know I'll, I'll be able to tell you once I get in there so um, I'm gonna turn my camera around and I'll be back I'll try the fries out first because uh, good and hot hmm. color fries are always really good um, especially when they're fresh and hot they're really really good if they've cooled off a bit they're just they're still good but they're uh, they're not nearly as good of course when they're hot really good fries um they could put a good amount of salt on them get these little skinny ones and you also get the big fat ones so depending on what kind of mood you're in you might like them both i like them both um my favorites are really skinny crispy ones though i like those the best so their fries are good um i usually dip mine in some barbecue sauce i didn't ask for them this time but that's what i usually do um now the pub house burger Looks like it is a double. No, yeah, no. It's hard to tell. It's very, very greasy, just to let you know. Let me just take a bite and we'll see. It's got bacon on it for sure. Um, I like it that they put it in the paper because you got to have something to hold on to. It's definitely a double. There are there. Um, it's got um, bacon on it. Bacon, cheese, onions. It's got some kind of sauce. It's like a like a peppery kind of sauce. I don't, I don't know what the sauce is. Um, like I said, it's a very greasy, messy burger. I'm assuming that's some kind of sauce. It looks like a, some kind of um, a white sauce, or maybe it's a, um, I don't know what it is. I didn't look up the description, so I don't know what it is. So, um, but it's really, really good. It's greasy, but it's really good. The flavors are excellent. 
love the pretzel bun. The pretzel bun is like probably beyond that sauce and the burger itself, the pretzel bun is really, really good. It's got that little, um, like that tough um, outside, like a like a soft pretzel does. Go that top, um, the skin has kind of got that little chew to it, but then the bun itself is really, really soft. So pretzel buns, I think I'd eat a pretzel bun on any burger out there. If I could buy them for home, I might look for them and see. Onion bun's still my favorite, but these pretzel buns are pretty daggone good. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to fight, figure out if I can find these somewhere. So this is good. This meal is probably it's it's not the best burger I've ever had, but it's pretty daggone good. Um, I'm gonna give it a four and a half just because it is so good. The flavors are really good. Um, got multiple layers of flavors. It's not just a burger. It's got the buns and the sauce and the onions and everything about it's really really good. So, yeah, I'm gonna give it a four and a half. If you have a Culver's in your area, you should definitely try this burger out because I think you'd really really like it. And I hope you enjoy this video and catch you next time. Okay, I was curious what kind of sauce and stuff was on here, and it's got two special things. It's got two kinds of cheese on it, which I think is pretty cool. But it's got a uh, it's got pickled onions on it, which adds a different flavor to it. And it's got their bistro sauce. So bistro sauce and pickled onions. I think the pickled onions is what I really taste a lot of. Um, it's really really good. Whatever, whatever combination of pickled onions and that sauce is, it's excellent. So yeah, I'm still sticking with four and a half, but it's definitely worth trying still.